More than 42 million Americans have sleep apnea, a condition where breathing is interrupted during sleep. While many associate the disorder with men, studies show one woman has it for every two to three men. But because of more subtle symptoms in women like headaches and fatigue, women are much less likely to be diagnosed, which could lead to dangerous consequences. For decades, busy accountant Jenny Potts felt tired all the time. It was a struggle to try to, to put in a full day. She'd fight to stay awake, but had no idea what was wrong. Driving back and forth, I would get tired to the point where I'd have to pull over on the side of the road and almost take a cat nap. After enrolling in a sleep study, the diagnosis finally came. Severe sleep apnea, a disorder that causes you to stop breathing during the night. Well, often women will complain that they can't stay asleep throughout the night. They wake up frequently throughout the night. I was told 20 to 30 occurrences in an hour is sleep apnea. I had about 124 occurrences in an hour. Dr. Kelly Brown says while up to 15% of women have sleep apnea, it's often undiagnosed. The danger is that there are a lot of um, medical disorders that are associated with obstructive sleep apnea. Untreated, it can increase your risk for high blood pressure, heart attack, stroke, and diabetes. 50% of patients with atrial fibrillation have untreated sleep apnea and about 50 to 70 percent of patients with stroke have sleep apnea. And get this. Patients with poor sleep are more prone to certain cancers, particularly breast cancer. Treatments range from losing weight to CPAP therapy, and that's what worked for Jenny. I'm just totally refreshed. And focusing on work. One interesting way Dr. Brown says she's finding people coming to her office wondering if they might have sleep apnea has to do with the popularity of activity trackers like the Fitbit or Jawbone, which monitor your sleep patterns.